This could be you guys. Shout out to Trifecta. What's up, YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug. And big ups to this company called Trifecta for sending me this big box of meals to show you guys. Now you may ask, what is Trifecta? Trifecta is a meal delivery service, right? And they specialize in plant-based protein, organic produce, gluten-free, no GMO, low saturated fat, um, low salt, low, high fiber, low sugar, calorie and portion controlled meals. And that's right up my alley, guys. When you receive the box of meals, it's going to come in this big box filled with dry ice. So your meals will be perfectly fine, packaged well, and, you know, chilled until you get it. Of course, when you get it, put it in your refrigerator immediately. And so forth. Let's talk about the food that they sent me and what you can be getting in the mail. Because that's what I'm interested in showing you. So I'll show you one by one. So this is how it comes packaged, guys. Got the Trifecta logo up there. Labeling. So this is beef and cheddar chili bowl. So it breaks down. See calories, protein, carbs, fat. Enjoy within seven days. Gives you more stuff on the back. Nutrition facts, of course. Then you have... They'll give you heating instructions. And what's cool about um, Trifecta, I did see on some of them, they did give air fryer um, instructions or directions. We also got a bacon and cheddar chopped steak. There's no bread with this. This is just get the bacon, the burger with the green beans cool you got a South Philly cheesesteak not bad I like that I might make that for dinner I'm not sure so we're gonna make two meals today. we're gonna make lunch and then we're gonna make dinner later I don't know which one of these I like this I don't know how to pronounce this Penang chicken curry never heard of Penang before but Penang chicken curry well, I'm down to try it and remember, these are portion control. So if you're, you know, if you're looking to lose weight, eat cleaner, this is definitely the company to go with for sure. Classic Chicken Club, nice. Oh yeah, I already showed you this. And unfortunately, I forgot to tell them that I am allergic to seafood. But they even gave me a chipotle, chipotle uh, shrimp. And this King Pao Shrimp Stir Fry, which I'm jealous because this is something that I think I would like if, if I was able to eat shrimp. I know I would tear this up. But I'll give them away. There's no problem. And what also came with it is these uh, burgers. So I can have this with some of these meals as well and just cut it up. Or have it by itself. That. Some chicken breasts. Already got your grill marks on them. Very cool. And. Wish I could eat it. They gave me some salmon too. So I'm going to freeze. I'm going to freeze the seafood stuff. And give it to somebody. Very cool. So yeah, I'm going to start off with this one. This is the beef and cheddar chili bowl. Seasoned with ground beef sauce, butter, squash, and cheese. Oh, and one, one thing I love about this company. Their meals are vacuum sealed. So you know that they're fresh. I mean, super vacuum sealed. <laughs> Alright, so let's get this out. Now, I could put this in the microwave if I want, but, you know, 
we don't microwave like that over here. I could, but we're going to whip out a gadget, put it in there, and cook it. And remember, guys, this is portion control, so none of us are going to get the itis from eating this stuff. And that the itis means, you know, you know how you get sleepy after you eat a meal because it was so much? No. But we're going to lose weight and feel better about ourselves from eating this. That's what's going to happen, right? Right. Shout out to Chef Favor. We back at it again. Let me get my griddle on right quick. And for those who might not know, this Chef Favor grill slash air fryer slash griddle has a see-through window with a light. So you can actually see what you're cooking. I think that's pretty cool. Link will be in the description on that. All right, let's add our food. But before I do that, I'm going to spray with some avocado oil. And then I'm just going to scoop out this. Get it all in there. Let that cook for about five, six minutes or so. And guys, because this cooks top and bottom, all it took was about three and a half minutes to get here. This could be you guys. And don't worry guys, for dinner, we're gonna make some chicken breast with something. Eat guys. So I got some rich crackers. I'm just gonna dip it right in there. Maybe I need a fork or something. Get this on there. I just feel like eating it this way because it's lunch. But you first. You got it? Mm -hmm. That's good. That's real good. Not bad. Let's have some with the squash and just the meat itself. So we can taste that. You got it? Mm-hmm. That's good. If you like pepper, definitely add some hot sauce. Um, salt is perfect. I don't need to add any salt. If you like stuff salty, obviously you would have to add some. But this is the salt content. The salt content in this is 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 perfect. I I wouldn't add any salt to it. So that's cool. This tastes good, guys. I definitely would have this again. You know, for lunch. Now, if this was dinner, I don't know. <laughs> I'd have to add something to it. But this is perfect for lunch. Mm. One thing I want to say it now that I'm done. The ground beef was well seasoned. Not only did I didn't have to add any salt, I didn't feel it needed any further seasoning. Only thing that, and, and I've said before, it needed some hot sauce. It did have a kick after like my fourth or fifth bite. But like I said, if you like, if you, you know, normally like hot food, of course, you know, they're going to, you're going to have to add some hot sauce because it come, it makes sense because everybody's tolerance to spice is different. So of course they're going to have to make it as mild as possible so that it would appeal to the masses. And that just makes sense. If it was my company, I'd do that too. If you want it hot, have at it. Add your own sauce. But this was perfect, guys. Perfectly seasoned to my standards. All right, it's dinner time, guys. And I was torn between the Philly cheesesteak and this one, but I'm going with this one. This is, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, Penang Chicken Curry. You know, my family's Jamaican, so why not? So it's seasoned chicken thigh and curry sauce with cauliflower rice broccoli, almonds, and carrots. 
as a diabetic, that's absolutely fantastic. Carbs are a little high, but that's okay. 18 grams of carbs, I ain't going to sneeze at that. We'll pair with an avocado to bring all of that down, but this should be fantastic. And as a bonus for you guys, I'm going to cook up uh, two of these grilled chicken breasts and pair, you know, cut it up and put it with this meal to make it more full. Why not? But I'll just make both of them and, uh, well, not both of them, just this bunch, these two, and then I'll have the other one tomorrow for lunch or something, or even cut it up for dinner. Who knows? Introducing the Ninja Speedy. For my new viewers, new subscribers, this can cook two things at once. It can cook a pasta and protein at once in under 20 minutes, which is absolutely fantastic. And not only on top of that, it can air fry, it can bake, it can broil, it can uh, slow cook, it can sear and saute, broil, you name it. Proof. I'll leave a link in the description so you can fully check that out as well. But let's get cooking. I'm going to make a half a cup of broth for the steam. I'm going to put that in there as well. So since I know trifecta is not spicy, we're going to add a little spice to it. Just a little. I took the broccoli out, guys, because, you know, broccoli doesn't take that long to cook. Oh, still got a piece in there. Let me get that out. Okay. We'll put this in with like three minutes left. This is the broccoli. And by the way, guys, if you've not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. It's free. I'm going to spray it with some avocado oil to keep it moist and sexy. You know what I'm saying? And then I'm just going to dust it with that same seasoning from before. Just to give it some flavor. Caribbean flavor. And a uh, link will be in the description to that seasoning just in case you wanted to pick it up. Go ahead and close it up. Alright guys, speedy meals, bump it down to 375, guys I'm only going to do 8 minutes. Alright, I'll be back in under 8 minutes. They haven't made smell vision yet, but it's smelling pretty good in my kitchen right now. We've reached the no stove section of YouTube. I don't have a stove. That's why you see me cooking on all these gadgets. And I only have a microwave really just to warm up leftovers. I don't really use it. Eight minutes of my life. This could be you. I didn't need to flip it or anything. All the links will be in the description. Food and gadget. All right, let's open this up. Of course, that's gonna be hot. Oh, look at that. Nice. So what I'm gonna do is cut one chicken breast up and cut it, um, throw it in there and then we'll mix it up and we'll get a plate going. And just to show you guys, and these, you know, these chicken breasts were fully cooked anyway, so, but I just want to show you without flipping. Look, both sides are done. Well, charred.
I had to turn on my extra light, guys. It's only 5 o'clock, but I forget we're approaching winter and it gets dark very quick. <laughs> so I'm just going to mix all of this up. Look at that. And then we're going to make a plate. Now this is a meal that will fill me up. Let's go ahead and take a bite. And for those who may not know, I don't know if I mentioned it, I am diabetic, so this would be considered a okay diabetic dinner. Let's get this big carrot in there. You take the first bite. You got it? Mmm. Good. Ooh, yeah, the curry is good. I was about to say it's spicy, but I forgot I added my own spice. <laughs> I watched some other of um, some YouTubers that um, done videos on trifecta, and they said some you know some needed seasoning, some needed some spice on whatever they uh, particular meal that they were eating. So that's why I added. You got it? Mmm. This is good though. Curry seasoning is definitely on point. Chicken breast is not dry. Flavorful. It's good. Now remember, this is Trifecta is clean eating, guys, so if you're not interested in clean eating, then this might not be for you. But if you are, you put the money where your mouth is, and you'll see the results. Got it? Mmm. Put some lime. And some um, garlic, salt, pepper. Bomb. Well, that was super fun. I'm going to make this tomorrow for sure. Alright, guys. So, this is what it will look like when you click the link that I'm going to put in the description. It's going to say, build your plan. And these are the different styles of foods you can, you know, order. Um, so, you got clean eating. You got Whole30. You got paleo, keto, vegan vegetarian those are the different styles of food and, and as you can see all clean and then from there of course you just follow how many you need and so forth like that but like I said go ahead and click that link look at you know what all it has to offer because this if you're looking for clean eating then this is it Now, these meals break down to about $14 a meal. But like I said earlier, you got to put your money where your mouth is. So, I'm just going to leave it right there, guys. So, again, thanks to Trifecta for sending this out. I really do appreciate it. So, that I can show my viewers and subscribers yet another meal delivery service. Because I've done videos on many others. So, this is just another one. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you found something informative about it. Because that's what I want. I don't want to, you know, when these type of things come out, I, I want to at least show you. You may not even be fully interested, but I at least want to show you. So, if it comes up in conversation in your life, you're like, yeah, Doug did that. I saw it. And you can give your opinion, whether it's a gadget or one of these meal delivery services. That's all I got, guys. Hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. If anything, thanks for just even looking at my video. It's Cooking with Doug. I'm out.